And in Barbados, government ministers have been appointed following the election of Prime Minister Mia Motley. To discuss the economic challenges facing Barbados and this new team, earlier we spoke with the economist Jeremy Stephen and asked whether or not the Prime Minister, who is also the Minister of Finance, is on the right track. I think she's just, she, she's been doing the right things thus far in terms of how she's tried to inculcate or try to encourage confidence in the economy. Um, yes, the size of the cabinet, the ministerial cabinet, has been a challenging one to sell to Barbadians. And whereas, as you said earlier, she said she wanted to focus on efficiency, I think that's the right message to, to, to put out there. Uh, but in terms of the particulars, that is, you know, how do we deal with our debt? They, they during the election, were talking about uh, debt reprofiling. And I wanted more details there because given where we are, given how many downgrades we've had as an economy, uh, given the stagnation that we've had for a number of years, I, I was thinking to myself, you know, well, we need a little more detail now because it's going to be very hard to reprofile. So maybe they're going to come up with more information. So insofar, I think what she's been trying to do is, again, to rally confidence, to make every Barbadian feel as if they have to be involved in this recovery, as opposed to government uh, just being the ones that are supposed to lead this recovery. And insofar, people have been talking. There's been a lot more civic engagement. And that goes outside of economics. It, it, there's a confidence, there's an interest, there's an active interest in what's going on in, in Barbados. So again, I, I think it's the right start, but again, I'm giving them 100 days to see how they manage this and if they give way more detail as to the tough decisions that they're going to have to make, like reducing expenditure, which may very well lead to uh, job cuts. But one would hope the private sector picks up the um, excess labor in time, I, I really don't know. So again, I'm giving them 100 days before I really begin to nail them to the cross if they need to be nailed.